Hi everyone, I'm Pam Allen and I am a Canva geek, Canva community ambassador, and I'm just, I love Canva. So I wanted to go through some things with you um, to share that, um, and not for you guys to get all, oh no, what's going on kind of thing. You might've got an email about your design sharing links in Canva, okay? There's some changes happening. And what's happening is they're taking away the view only links and stuff. So I want, I'm going to walk you through that email a little bit better. Okay. All right. And even if you didn't get the email, you'll still be able to um, do this and figure out your links. Okay. So like I said, um, upcoming changes to your design sharing links in Canva. All right. So what's changing okay so remember how we used to have the view only share links well now they're going to be called public view links so that is very important to know this is under share um it's right there you will see um it will have a little green little thing it will say live when you do um share links now um yeah so here it goes the status of your design link so there you go. And it will show you who you're sharing it with. You can even do groups, but that's that's another video. Okay? So, um, what it's going to be, it be known now, will be called public view links. So, this is what you want to give people um, if you, they just want to view it. Okay? If you want them to have their own template, do their own thing with it, you would always give them the template link. But that's only like if you are um, like selling it and all that. So that yet another video. But this this is for view only when you want people just like if you're just sharing your your stuff. OK. All right. So um, next. All right. So another place is where they have some link um, new improvements is the websites. Um, now, granted, on Canva websites is not really official website, so I wouldn't be putting, you know, your your. Um, I wouldn't be building a website on Canva. However, you can use it for landing pages. You can use it for events. You can use it. I use it for my portfolio stuff like that. So. Um, so right now you can change up your links right here. You can have a URL, but you'll always have that. You can get a, a new domain. Canva has that all going. Eh, I don't think it's necessary. Um, I, I, I don't mind this all the time, but if I'm trying to save something, I just change it to a pretty link. I don't know if you, pretty link, bit.ly, stuff like that. Okay. And then, um, Let's see here. They do allow some, um, you can change up the tab preview here. You can give a website description. There's a password protection now. And, um, and then the link preview. So they're, you know, they're, they're doing their thing. It's just, it, it's not to a point that Google will ever like pick it up as a, website website like wordpress and stuff okay but it's doable for like landing pages i i like it all right and i do show that stuff in my my membership all right next thing is how to keep your share links accessible okay so this is what is really important so listen to this okay um these improvements bring additional features and enhance security. And so what's going to happen is you need to go to this, like Canva, then slash settings, slash share the share links. I This is clickable, so I'm hoping you guys will just click on this. Make sure you are signed into your Canva, and then it's going to bring you to a page, and I'm going to show you that right now. All right, so my page looked um, like this. I had 75 links, 75. It kept going. So what I did is I clicked on, see it says design type, 
last edited total views. I clicked right here and then it clicked all 75 of them. And let's go to the next. Oh. Okay, see, keep 75 designs accessible. All I did was go click this purple button, bam, it it updated all my links. So I don't have to worry about that anymore. They're already done. And I recommend you guys doing the same thing. Now you can go through the list. I didn't want to go through all 75. I'm sure not all 75 needed that link, but just in case, right? So I put the link here again. If you want to share your links, which make sure you're signed into your Canva. Um, it will show that and you just click the purple and you're done. Okay. Now let's talk about if you don't do it. All right. If you do nothing, if you decide you don't want to update your share links, which is perfectly fine, that's on you, then the affected links will no longer work after July 31st and your designs will be made private. So I highly recommend doing this. Highly recommend. Okay. And um, so you'll, you'll be able to still access the designs, but the people that have them will not be able to. So make sure you do this, okay? Please make sure you do this. All right, and let's remember the date, July 31st, okay? Um, let's try to get it done. I'll put some more reminders out there and everything. And I, I know I'll let my membership members know. I'll know I'll let um, my camera creations Facebook group know, and then I'll make sure that I, you know, put it everywhere. So you guys know, all right, just do it. It's real simple. It took like one minute. That's it. it took one minute. All right. Thank you very much. And I hope that you, um, got what you needed out of this video. Please join me in my camera creations with Pam, uh, Facebook. Um, gosh, I would love for you guys to, um, subscribe to my YouTube. I have so many Canva, um, videos up in there. All right. So, all right, you guys, thank you.